how's it going everyone? Uh, we're sitting here with Dennis Chambers and uh, I wanted to pick your brain a bit, Dennis, if you can. And we have a lot of beginner drummers that watch our channel and, and are trying to learn the drums. Um, so I wanted to ask you, what is your number one tip for young drummers getting started behind the kit? Just listening, you know, you have to listen to, you know, uh, the drummer play. Uh, if you're listening to somebody on record, you, you know, if you do any research on that drummer, you find out what his setup is. But when you listen to him, you can actually, once you find out what, how, what, how this drum setup or the setup of his kit is, and you listen to him, you can pretty much imagine, you know, um, what he's, you know, when you hear him hit, you can see him, you know, pretty much hitting the drum. You know, after you get the visual of, of that, that setup. Um, but, you know, when you listen to him play, you know, if, if he's playing. Okay, so a beginner wouldn't, wouldn't be able to know how to do that. Mm -hmm. You know, so, you know, you have to sit there, you know, and, and get your, your hands together, separate the, the left from the right. Then the nightmare comes in when you add your bottom half, you know, which is your hi-hat and your pedal. So you start with one at a, one at a time, you know, when, it, when uh, bring in one at a time with that groove the top half. And you bring the hi-hat. And then once you figure that out, then you try to, you know, like, uh, you know, put like a 16th note uh, on the right hand. That's more advanced, so. Yeah, okay, that's, that's yeah. a little more advanced. Yeah. But so overall, just listen. And just listen. Yeah. So in terms of that, do you just float up your iPod with a bunch of music to listen to? Or? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I will start off, you know, again, I will start off with something simple to listen to, you know. And there again, that's, that's that whole thing of, like, learning how to crawl before you learn how to run. Mm -hmm. You know, because when I, when I first learned how to play, it was just, about, you know, just like I said, just listening to James Brown and Fatbacks. Mm -hmm. at its basic form. Very cool. Hopefully that helps all you young drummers out there. Start listening. Do you find that a lot of drummers who are starting, especially the younger ones, they're not listening? Is that is that what you're seeing? They're listening, but you know, they're listening to um, guys who are you know uh, more advanced. You know, telling them you know how to do all this crazy stuff that have nothing to do with keeping gigs. Hmm. Um, you know, and the reason being is because they, they want to learn the flash before they learn how to play a groove. Mm -hmm. And, you know, if you can't play the groove, then you won't be able, you won't have the opportunity to play the flash because nobody's going to call you to play the grooves if you don't know how to do that and mm -hmm. all you do is flash. Mm -hmm. So keep it you simple. Can, you can sit home and do flashes all day, but... You'd be a broke guy sitting home. <laughs> waiting for your phone to waiting ring. Waiting for your phone ringing and it ain't going to happen. Right, until right. Until you learn how to play music. And, 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 and let's break music down. It all depends on what kind of music it is. Mm -hmm. You know, um, 
you know, if you're playing metal music, then um, um, there's not, there's a different kind of groove with metal music. And, and, but it's all, it's a lot of flash, mm -hmm. you know, and that's why, you know, my hat's, my hat is off to those guys because they didn't, you know, like, you know, it's, I mean, you know, first of all, when you listen to these guys play, they sound like athletes, mm -hmm. you know, and um, they didn't force, you know, that style of playing on any other style of music other than what they created, which is metal. Mm -hmm. So my hat's off to them. You yeah. Know? Um, you know, there's a guy up in Canada, I'm here, in fact, he's in Canada, Flo Munier. Yeah. Munier. Uh, Munier, yeah. Please forgive me if I'm saying his name wrong, but he played with this group called Cryptopsy. Yeah. And, I mean, I love that guy to death, you know, because, I mean, I sit there and watch him play, <laughs> and we're like, All right, there's no way I'm going to do that. You yeah. Know, forget it, you know. Yeah. That's, yeah. that's a lot of dedication. But I know what it takes to do it. Yeah. You know, it's a lot of dedication. And, you know, when I sit there and watch him play, I mean, he's, he's, he's playing at like 80,000 miles an hour. Mm -hmm. So he was able to find a way to, to focus on the groove, but use the flash in uh -huh. there. And that's what you uh -huh. said, talking about uh -huh. metal styles of music. Uh -huh. And we've had flow out on Drumeo. Um, we've also have a bunch more lessons from Dennis inside of Drumeo too. So if you guys want to check out more, head on over to Drumeo.com. We've got a lot of great tips for beginner drummers all the way to advanced drummers. Thank you very much. Thank you. We'll see you guys later.